Hey, my name is Xenia to walk about to let's play Tales of Shadow Axe, and today we'll also be doing a demo as well, and it is a beta of um, the upcoming game that might be out already, because the Tales of Shadow Axe will be going up in November, while the beta, I think, might be coming out this month regardlessly. So, if you don't know, if you don't know for the title and the thumbnail, Attention, all proud that's warriors. Trunks. Have you, you know who the hell that is. Time Patrol? As a time patroller, you'll prevent history so, from being yeah. changed. Okay. Our duty is to protect everyone's memories and help return history to the way it should be. Yeah. But we need your help. The only requirements are confidence in your capabilities and, of course, a strong desire to protect history. We've got a school for honing your skills. Yeah, and a, a fully school of them. Freaking right, A, man. Why not use your strength to help out a great cause? <clears throat> We're always on the lookout for powerful warriors. Okay, then. Listen carefully. Wow, I like how Today Trunks is like loud and she's like, oh, I'm quiet. What the hell? <laughs> Anyways, if you don't already know for Tales Shadow X, please tell me any game you want me to play for the first 20 minutes of your choosing the campaign game that's already been chosen before, and uh, your name will be credited first, in the game the uh, video. City limits is prohibited. Really? Time patrollers wishing to fly when not on duty are required to obtain a flying license. Please help keep Content City safe by obeying its traffic laws. Okay. Lastly, any alteration of history is a grave offense. Our missions come with the risk of changing history. So you must exercise the utmost caution. Avoid making changes to history like Trunks did. <laughs> Keeping these things in mind, please carry out your missions safely. For the sake of the world I like how the and audio's history, off for that girl. We look forward to welcoming each of you to the Time Patrol. Also, for Toys Remember, this is also based on the Japanese game, too. So, um, yeah. Anyways, everybody, this is Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2. This is the sequel to Dragon Ball Xenoverse 1 that came out about, I think, last year. Or the year before that. But realistically, uh,. I still haven't beaten last year's game. Uh, I got to like the Frieza saga or something, and then I kind of got stuck there. And or so I beat Frieza, and I just got kind of tired of it because it was so much grinding. And I was like, "Oh my god, dude, too much grinding," which uh, could be a good thing and bad thing depending. But a lot of people really like Xenoverse One, so this is why this is Xenoverse Two. So if you don't already know that, so yeah, so. Anyways, let's get on to the game, I guess we could say. Just, uh, it's connected to the servers of the universe, because this is also the beta and or first episode of the, the game. Because, you know, it's basically the same freaking thing. So, just to let you guys all know, because I, I already know this. I've seen a lot of videos from uh, DBZ Zanto, uh, freaking, I think Bandai Namco or IGN or something like that. But, regardless, I've seen a lot of videos of this stuff. And we have 40 minutes to go. Yeah, that's, that's going to be great. 40 minutes of a Taylor Shadow X. Yay, oh, boy. That's right. Yay. I need to choose someone for that special mission. So at this point right here, you're going to choose... Who should I choose? Who your character is. And I'm like, uh, well, you're about to see here in a minute. So... Yeah, 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 get on with it, yeah, it's just gonna say words and stuff, I'm like, yay, you know, basically. Alright, so, it's choosing which, yeah, so, of course I like to go through all of them, Earthling, Sane, uh, Majin. Yeah, just checking them out. I'm reading two. And Namekian and Frieza, which I was like, interesting with Frieza, so. I was gonna go with the boy, but I decided to change it. Because I was like, you know what? Now nah, it's with the girl. I don't usually ever pick girls for some reason. And there's not really that many girls on the Dragon Ball Z games that you could play as. Not a lot of them. Especially like Android 18. You know, there's that one. And, um. Chi Chi at times. But still. <laughs> also, Pan. 
and uh, that's it. So yeah, you know that's interesting, you know. Okay, so I right hear I'm kind of customizing my character like a little bit, you know. Even though this is the beta slash demo, I should have not done it, including you know this is also tail should wax. So I was like, I'm gonna do it gardenly. I just didn't really think I was gonna do it for this long that I wanted to do it for. So that's interesting to say. So, uh, yeah. I realize that I'm not going to be able to do all these Tale of by the way, really quick, off topic. Uh, that uh, in October that I want to do, like, every week. I'm going to start doing every single Tale of I have uh, recorded for post-commentary. Because a lot of them are post commentaries except for Paper Mario Color Splash, which is the only one that's so far is live. Commentary. Um, will be, you know, coming in November, because I feel like that's the appropriate time for a lot of these games to go. Even though two or three of them has already been out, maybe even, yeah. For like two to three months uh, which is this one's like that it when it comes out in November uh, not sure when but that's basically is the idea so it gives a war 4 and uh, God Eater 2 rage burst and attack on Titan and doom and what's not so there's there's quite a few I just need to really focus on Gears of War Ultimate Edition, and it's 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 very very freaking close to finishing. But when you're probably seeing this video, it's probably already finished. So go check out that Let's Play if you want to. If not, it's cool. Eliminator of evil and defender of justice. I just want to point out I don't know why this is here. is here. So far, I realized in the first 20 to 40 minutes of this game, I have nothing to do with the hey, Great Sandman. Now it's your turn. Say yeah, man, my bad. Gohan, do I really have to do this with you? Who is this Gohan you speak of? <laughs> I'm Who Sayama. is this Gohan that you speak of? This Not is even, no time man. for hesitation. We have a responsibility it's like you're bad, man. to defend Who is this planet? Bruce Wayne you speak of? Well, I swear. let's go. Ugh, fine, fine. I'll do it. Eliminator of Evil and Defender of Justice! Great she just doesn't look that great, just like his. And yes, I actually waited till she could do that little thing. I know there was like a little wonderful. thing at the end. You're perfect! Just perfect! Yeah, you right. nailed it! No, I don't feel like I did. Uh, are you sure? I don't think you did. To be honest, that felt pretty good. Are you serious? Great! Next, we'll have to decide on a perfect duo combination for What is wrong with you people? Okay, got it. And of course, she does the whole thing with Great. the voice. That's the spirit. One incoming report. Upon assessment of the situation, I have concluded that. Just wait one minute. <laughs> what was that for? You've been specifically chosen for that critical mission. Now go out there and do it. Why? Okay then, that's a interesting way to say. For real. Anyways, I just, really, I just want to point out something. Uh, during the time of this recording, sorry, uh, PlayStation VR is out, and it does look interesting. I admit that, but I'm just not that sure if I really want to try it. I mean, I, yeah, I want to try it, but I don't know if I'm going to pay $400 for the damn thing, you know? So, yeah. Damn, look at that Shemron, man. That's all I have to really say is like, look at that Shemron. That's a pretty cool looking statue like this. I'm not gonna lie. Wait, didn't he oh wait, do we have a flying license? I'm like, didn't Trunk say you have to have like a flying license or something or or the great elder of time if that's still the name for it from the last game? Which I believe it is still. So. I believe. Regardlessly. Wow, 
Welcome home! Yeah, it is! Supreme Kai of Time! Whatever. <laughs> did I say the Elder of Time? <laughs> oh, even if I did say the Elder of Time. I'm pretty sure I said something like the Supreme Kai of Time or something like that, so. Oh, cheer say that'd be funny. The Supreme Kai of Time has graciously appeared to give you her best wishes after all. I mean, really. Don't you think you're being a bit cold? No. You just won't let this girl talk. Oh, so you're looking for the old man. Well, when yeah, it's clearly much better past, than you, you know? He went off somewhere in a hurry. Not Why even... don't you go and look for him? That's what I was going to do. You know what? I'm pretty sure that he was the happiest to hear about your success. Why? Tell me, Supreme Kai of Time. Why? I swear there's going to be a Supreme Kai of everything. There is a Supreme Kai of... Of, um... Of... Of Ki... Kai. Yeah, Supreme Kai of Kai. <laughs> there is a Supreme Kai of... Middle. And the Supreme Kai of... Galaxy number 25. Or something. I don't know. I'm pretty sure there is. Supreme Kai's of all that freaking jazz. Because I haven't seen Super... Yet, so Dragon Ball Z Super, I haven't seen it, or Dragon Ball Super, I haven't seen it at all. Uh, I already know it's a Goku Black and all that stuff, which is gonna be his universe too, so that's pretty awesome. It's gonna be sweet, you know. A uh, little promotion, I guess, say. Uh, if you pre ordered the game, you can get a downloadable code for uh, Dragon Ball Z Universe 2 to get certain uh, characters and our uh, costumes like uh, Goku Black. And uh, a couple other things you should probably really go check it out with your pre order of Dragon Ball Z Xenoverse 2. Or Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2. So, my bad. <sighs> I feel so good with the air just coming down from the thing. Yep, so right here, I'm trying to figure out... Who are you? Ooh, I'm so sorry, I just had a yawn, I was getting a little slippy there. Uh, I had a yawn. <laughs> okay, anyways, I'm trying to figure out um, what I'm supposed to be doing, because I thought it said I go like, talk to the shop or something, and it's like, oh, a little, like, blue house and stuff, so I was like, oh, okay, you know, I'm gonna go figure out where this is at, and what I found out is that it's, it's not even here in the same place, so I was like, oh, man. Damn. Uh, I'm reading what he actually has to say so I don't get lost, but you know what I do? I had to go to the other two anyways, and I asked some questions, even though I repeat, I think, one of them? Maybe two? Welcome, I don't know. Friend. But I repeat one of them twice or something, I think, to Greetings. each other, and I'm like, okay. So, like, what? Hello. Hello. That's all you have to say, even though you say a bunch of other words, but all you say is hello. Like a freaking Australian accent or something. You British thing. A dingo in my baby. <laughs> Shriek on the Bobby. Oh man, wood. Anyways, um, let's see. I'm actually trying to figure out about this whole entire map thing, and I'm like, wait. We have nice new items in stock. That is great. Uh, we have nice new items. Does it look like the robot from like GT Guru or something like that? Gyu or I don't remember how to say that damn name. So, also with the Dragon Ball GT uh, series, I guess it's basically considered, and it was never canon uh, because Super is out. And you know, it's like, well, okay. I can see GT, I guess, not even happening at all. Like, what? What? Like, what is it? Like, is it a big, gigantic what if animated anime series or something? Like, I don't know. I personally actually own the entire Dragon Ball GT anime on uh, DVD. And I, I'm not gonna say and Blu-ray. Well, I like to say it like that. It sounds interesting. It sounds, you know, fun and shit. But, but I really don't. It's just on DVD. Um, or DVDs. Uh, but still, regardless, like. Um, I never seen the whole thing. I've, I've, I know I've seen a lot of the episodes. I don't think I really finished watching every single episode ever. Of course, I like to do the same thing with Dragon Ball uh, Z because I don't have all the seasons. I am missing one. I think 
four. No, I think it's just one. I think I have four. And six and seven. So yeah, one, six, and seven, possibly four. Uh, even though I, th I, th I do think I have four. It's, I think I have four over there. Yeah, I think that's four. So yeah, you know, that is the ones I am missing. And um, yeah, there's not really much else I could say. I'm also missing a lot of the Dragon Ball Z movies. Uh, there's like at least 14 of the freaking movies, or 13 or 15. I don't know how many really. Anyways, uh, I've like maybe a good seven of them, maybe six of them. So I'm still looking for a lot of them, basically. Basically, is it's the word I'm going for. And that's just a word I use a lot, so whatever. You know? So, that's cool with me. That's cool with me. Also, we got Elder Kai talking to Supreme Kai of Time. And they're like, yo, you gotta go see what you could do in the universe of Xenoverse. And they're like, oh my god. No way. I should because Bandai Namco. <laughs> that made no freaking sense. Man, um, you know what's one Dragon Ball Z game they have to remake? They have to put in an HD collection or something. If you don't know what I'm talking about, I'm talking about Dragon Ball Z Budokai Tenkaichi. Uh, possibly two and three. I mean, yeah, you could still put in one. I would love to, to put in both of them, or sorry, all three of them. But if they're gonna do this whole the same thing with like Tenkaichi, or sorry, the, the original Budokai and only remaster one and three, and not two for some weird reason. Uh, then just do two and three, but if you can, do all three. So, for real, like Dragon Ball or Bandai Namco or whoever gets the decision to make this collection, please make a Dragon Ball Z Budokai Tenkai EG HD collection or something like that because that will freaking sell like hotcakes, man. That'll, that'll be like, like money printing for you guys. Because who doesn't love playing Dragon Ball Z Budokai Tenkai EG? Uh, two or three, and I mean, was not many really, 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 really people has played one, uh, but they're probably aware of it because you know, like, oh yeah, that's right, Tenkaichi, there's a two and there's three, so it has to be a one, though, you know. So they just want to make up a damn number for some reason, that'd be weird, but still, you know, I think you'll possibly be the best idea, including I am. Let's play Dragon Ball Z Budokai Tenkaichi. At the moment in time, so that's that's a thing to let you guys all know about that. Anyways, we're gonna do a lot of training here with uh, by a man. Oh my god, I can't right. talk or read. Saba, Saba man, Saba man, the Sandmans, the little Sandmans. The Vegeta and Nampa's like, oh my god, go fight my minions of Sandman or something. Saba man, and they're like, no, and Yancha dies. That's really how it goes. So yay. I'm actually getting very tired right now, and I shouldn't be because I really need to record this and possibly one more video. Well, yeah, possibly one more video if I can. And um, there goes my fan, which I totally forgot to turn off. I'm trying to... There we go. Barely turned it off with my freaking toe, man. Barely, like, reaching it. Like, it's it was on the brink of destruction, of, of the heatness of me talking to you guys of not knowing what to do and I'm just fucking clamoring around with the controller trying to do what it says on the screen to do. I'm like, you know, okay, you know. Whenever it actually gets check marked, there we go. You see, that magic just happened. That means I could do things. So anyways, um what what else? Uh I would love to do more Tail Shadow X's on a lot of other games. But we gotta see what's gonna happen, you know? Oh And for some other games I don't feel like I could do a Tail Shadow X like Azura Strike Gun Vault 2, I would love to, but it's portable and I can't do it. So I was like, okay, you know, maybe review one day. One day. Just like I'm supposed to do with Azura Strike Gun Vault 1. So I'm like, oh my god. I am an idiot. Even though I already got the Striker Pack. But I didn't realize there's so many freaking hidden games that's coming out this holiday season, like Shantin, uh Half Genie Hero for Wii U. Uh, especially this one, Wild Guns Reloaded for the PS4. Uh, River City, uh, sorry, yeah, River City Ransom Tokyo Rumble or something like that for the 3DS. That's like, 
I don't know, this holiday season is going to get crazier and crazier. And I'm trying not to spend money, so... Yeah, because of these reasons. There's like, games I didn't even know, like, for real, like... Like, Wild Guns Reloaded? Seriously? And I, I knew that Shantae Pirate... Oh, sorry, not Pirate's Curse. Had Genie Heroes a game, but it, I didn't know it was coming out with the which I'm super excited for. Uh, also, um... River City Ransom Tokyo Rumble, I really do want to get, but I know it's somewhat rare. So, I don't know. I have to see which site's better so far. What I'm seeing, it's been Crunchyroll. Really, it's been Crunchyroll, so that's pretty freaking really excited for me. You got it. Yeah, I got it! Yay! So, but the biggest thing of all, I'm trying to save my money for my capture card, is a uh, Elgato gaming capture card. It's just, I need it. I, I've been needing it for a while. Like this, it it should be, you know, live, which is not live, it is post-commentary, just me making it feel like it's live, which it's not live at all, because I'm even holding the freaking PS4 controller, and I'm like, yeah, this is live, uh, not even, so, yeah, I, I just feel like this has to happen, like, I, I need to get that that freaking capture card now. It's a part of my life. And also I need to get some splitters for the HDMI for my Xbox One and PS4 and possibly even PS3. Possibly. Uh, for you, I think I'm high. I think I'm high. I'm not saying I am, but I think I'm high. Because I have to see how this whole capture card thing works out. I don't know. You know? I just gotta see how it works out. Uh, of course I'm trying out mostly with the PS4 with the HDMI capture card. Uh, cause not really many games have been coming out for the Xbox One. I really want to go so far, and the only game that came out, and it's probably be, probably going to be the only game that's going to come out this year that's going to be pretty excited for the Xbox One is Gears of War 4. Like seriously, that's that's it. I don't think there's going to be any other game on the Xbox One exclusively that I'm going to be getting on the console to like, yeah, you know, fun and shit. You no, know, nothing like that. So we're just going to have to wait and see, you know. Um, there's other games like, you know, Dead Island, uh, uh Collection, I want to get those, because, you know, also the, the Bioshock Collection, which I am serious, I don't, I do need that collection, because it's the only collection of something I actually don't own, but I'm also going to go to Xbox One, most likely, my personal opinion, but hey, um, what else is there, uh, I know there's a, Killer Instinct, like, like limited more. edition or something like that, that has all the character to what's not, but, uh, well, we just have to see what happens, really. Uh, what else is there? Hmm. Um, well, there's Scalebound. I forgot about Scalebound. Ah, oh, you know what? Yeah, talking about Scalebound and Cuphead and, and all these other great, uh, uh, freaking games that I can't remember at this moment in time. When did they come out? Uh, are they like next year thing or what? Scale down. You gotta check this shit out. Scale down. Is... Yes, it is coming in 2017. Oh my god! Okay, let's check up Cup Head. Cup Head. Cup Head is coming out. Uh, it says this year, 2016. So, is that true? I don't know. But. I am still looking forward to it. Uh, it's Cuphead, you know? Um, oh yeah, there's also a uh, We Happy Few. Like, we could possibly happy. We could happy. Uh, I think that's Xbox or something. Let's see. It's 2016 as well. But we'll have to see about that. There's just a lot of freaking things coming out this holiday season. I really want to try out, but like I said, we're gonna have to for sure see what happens overall because there's nothing really gigantic coming out in December. So maybe I will focus a lot of my time on stuff in December because I'm no longer going to the swamp. There's no point to it because you know no one's going really. It's it's it's, it's gonna hold and. Uh, you know, there's just no point. Uh, there is still a point to go to the first source and stuff, you know? Hell yeah, I always go to the first source, for real. Especially I don't know how to actually do my shit there. Um, so yeah. 
uh, there's a lot of games to really be honest that's just coming out and this is this, this feels like the year that oh, games are great I have a feeling we're not done yet. uh because i haven't really felt like there's been a bad game this year and my personal opinion it doesn't feel like it but there could have been a bad game this year. I'm just not too sure about it really right now. Oh, no, 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 no. Wait, 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 wait. I just, I just thought of a game. There is a game that's bad this year. Mighty number nine. Well, I've been told, but a lot of people don't hate it, hate it. It's just different and not the best. And there is problems with it, but it's not the worst, I guess. And I've seen worse. Like Sonic Boom and 06 and as soon as 4. ET and shit, but you know, um, I feel like, you know, I need to find a way to, you know, save a lot of money, because there's also Pokemon Sun and Moon is coming out, and Sword Online Hollow Realization, and you know, all these games, I seriously need to write down, just so I can remember the actual dates from here on out, because November is where we have to really pay attention, including Dark Wars Universe 2, which we're talking about and playing right here, anyways, so, yeah, anyways, Oh my god, it, it, I forgot how annoying it actually starts to get to try to actually fight these stupid, uh, Simon, Simon, whatever, fucking men. So, yeah! I am getting very tired. Very tired. Look at that shit. There's no way I could do all that shit. I don't get how that's gonna move. You just dance and they like mimic you or just tease you. I don't know. And you just somehow weaken them or kill them or something. I don't know. Makes no freaking sense, man. Uh, anyways, let's see here. What else is going on? Really quick. I just want to say thank God to Xbox One actually having some good exclusives for once. Because I'm not saying that the 360 generation sucked. I mean, yeah, there was Gears of War and Halo and Fable, but the thing is. There's not really many exclusives. I feel like, oh, dude, no, that's not even an exclusive. You can play on a PS3. So, there's really not many exclusives on the Xbox. It's kind of sad, but Xbox did pretty well, though. Um, I don't know what else. Like, Dragon Ball Z Connect and Sonic Free Riders. I don't like that shit. Uh, but I can't say, you know, there were some other good games that in the beginning of the lifespan of the Xbox, a lot of people didn't notice. Uh, there was like, uh, what was it? Uh, shoot. Akai Katana, Death Smiles, uh, sequel to that too. There is uh, Lost Odyssey, uh, Last Radiant, and a couple other ones I can't remember really now. Now look at I am freaking freaking tired. Way freaking tired. Yeah, I'm way pretty tired. Also, I just don't get why Capcom doesn't release Dead Rising 1 and 2 together other than making them separate for, for $20. If they were together, they could have been as a $40 bundle. That's all they had to do, and they're like, nah, man. We have to sell it separately. Just like how Capcom was doing with the Resident Evil. Like, I don't get these people. I don't get people. Why are we doing it that way? Just release Resident Evil 4, 5, and 6 if you want separately. See what Dead Rising, and then later on put it all in a collection or something. Call it like the Resident Evil uh, where it all changes edition or something. Collection. I don't know. And then uh, I know there's an Origins collection. There's an Origins collection that has 1 and 2, so I don't get why people don't just make 4, 5, and 6 a collection. You know, don't tell me it's going to be some bullshit like, oh, they couldn't fit all this. I mean, in one freaking disc, what's not? They do a Bioshock 1, 2, and 3. Well, Infinite, whatever it's 3. And it works, so I'm like, um, there's no excuse. Same with Uncharted. Thrilled and Nathan Drake collection, you know? So I'm like, I, I don't see the point of not having this collection a thing, you know? So, yeah. Just that's just personal my you know, opinion, but hey, let's see and wait. But, yeah, we got to wait and see, you know? Anyways, how much longer do we have to go? Because I am freaking falling asleep here, don't lie. Uh, I think it's another something minutes, like 13 or 15, oh my god. 
I'm gonna take for a ride. Man, I remember, I remember something. I have to make an intro. Oh my god, sorry. I have to make an intro for more of his Capcom 3. And, um. I think I'm gonna use Take Me For a Ride song as the intro. But I have to for sure see also. I am really Okay, I, I, I just like my head spin for like a minute. And then I'm so tired that I'm like, oh my god, no. You know? Okay. I like how right here you can go all out. Gun blazing. And I'm, I'm still getting tired. Let's see, what is in this room that I need is new, changed, or something? I don't know. But I can tell you one thing, I'm actually getting very interested in, wa very interested in watching Dragon Ball Z Super. I just every episode from here on out is interesting. Not like the first, I don't know, 20, 30 episodes, which is basically the movies or whatever I've been told. So still regardless, I'm pretty happy about it. Anyways. Come on, I'm looking forward to seeing what you can do. I did it. Yay. Level up. Also, if you guys are curious, why is there a black little bar in the in the bottom left hand corner? Is because I was recording this using the PS4 uh, share feature. And it has to have it there, which sucks, but it's fucking true. But if you're gonna tell me if there's a way to take it off, please let me know in the comments below, please. That 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 thing is annoying. To me personally, but I get it as a copyright issue. I get that, but still, it's annoying to me. Anyways. Wow, this is the lo longest fucking white loading screen I've ever really fucking noticed. Oh there we go, that's why. It's just we're we're jumping into whiteness. Okay. Now we're gonna go fight an actual Time Patrol mission. A finally a Time Patrol mission, which is basically like the first one in the game, including um, it's the first thing in the franchise, really, of the of the Z games or the Z anime, not the original Dragon Ball or GT or Super. I'm talking about Z. I'm talking about Z. If that made sense. Okay. Let's go, Queen Radix is fighting it out. Special beam cannon. There you go. This freaking evilness from the original uh, Xenoverse must have kicked in. Yeah, oh. Um. <laughs> what? Are you serious? I'm like, yeah, I'm here, I'm cool. Just ignore the ignore, ignore the girl that fell down on her ass. For real, that's like basically what has happened. And everybody's like, okay, we'll just get on with the battle. And Goku's like, well, if she's on my side, let's fight Raditz. So that's that's how it goes for. Character. No matter how much trash there is, it's still trash. No matter no matter how much trash there is, it's still trash. Because that's very true, man. As they tell me. No matter how much water there is, it's still water. I, I I love your explanation of trash, man. It's like not even, basically, you know. It's not even on that level. Oh, so basically, Elder Kai is telling me or telling us how to, you know, uh, what how the actual things must go, and you know, it's true, you know, especially being canon right to Raditz and go for holding him down, which you'll see him in, anyways, regardlessly. So I was like, yeah. I'm actually very tired. Like I said before. Oh. 
And you, I don't know who you are, but defend me with your life until I'm ready. Okay, no worries. I wonder how all the Dragon Ball Z characters, uh, oh, sorry, Z characters, all the Dragon Ball Z actors, voice actors, uh, feels without always making a Dragon Ball Z game every freaking year and or or some, like I wonder if they get Dragon Ball Z out. They're like, I'm tired of Dragon Ball Z. Put me in another anime like fucking Full of Alchemist or something. I don't know. I'm, I'm just saying. Maybe, maybe like, I, I, I get it. Just, I know that's some R in different animes too, where they came from other animes that was not being C. But they're like, well, I'm forever known as Krillin, you know? There you go. One hell of an epic attack. Dang. Serves you right. What was that? Um, Where did... I'm too like you're behind. I don't know how could they just be like. Well, okay, I can't send you my with my 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 Z warrior sense or something. But she's gone. Oh, what is that? Torless and Lord Slug from the movies. That's interesting. Oh wait, is this movie? Is this, uh, this movie? Is this game based on the movies? Like, like you know, the life, the tree of life, or whatever. Uh, tree of my, I don't remember. Uh, and then the Lord Slug, and then work. whatever Those else there is. That's interesting bad. if it's, it is or not. Because I didn't Except think I seen Cooler or Avenger Cooler or Meta Cooler, or whatever it is, including Broly and Bio Broly and Android and Thirteen or Super Android Thirteen, them. whatever it's called. So that's be interesting. Your job is also, is this like is this series like this in the game the universe? The it, it can't. Does it expand from this also to GT? Smooth. I'm just curious about that. Like, if it does, is it like uh, Nova Shamron and Omega Shamron and and all these so other damn Shamrons that I don't really care for or Sin Shin Shamron, history. whatever the freaking Ron is. I don't know. That's just Since curious. My personal opinion. Under the greatest Kai in the universe. There shouldn't be much to worry about. <laughs> as long as you listen to my advice, you'll come into your own eventually. And... Yeah, we get it. You really do ramble, old man. Listen here, Supreme Kai of Time. I'm only about a millennium older than you. Only that a millennium. Oh my god, dude. Man. What are you saying? Anyone who laid eyes on you would easily call you an old man. It's true. Don't even try to compare yourself to an adorable girl like me. You call yourself adorable? How do you find a hat with a head that big? Ah, that's all from us for the moment. We'll tell you more about the world later on. <laughs> okay. Okay, then. You've got to be bored half to death after listening to his speeches. Am I right? Maybe. Allow Maybe me to he's walk okay. You out. This way, please. Okay. Hey, wait! How much longer do we you have in the video? We have, like, that? like, six minutes or something. Can I survive six minutes? I, I could try. I could really try. Freaking Elder Kai, man. Yep, I'm I'm definitely falling asleep. I am getting dizzy to the point that I am very tired. I'm not falling asleep because the game is boring. It just it is a little bit when you're post commentating. The game's not boring at all for me. It's just it's just post commentating wise, it's dumb. And um This is why I need an Elgato gaming capture card. Please Bandai Namco or Elgato.com Somebody, please help me get an Elgato gaming capture card. Not an S, not a 60 frames per second. No, I need the original version. 
I'm just I'm just saying, you know, personally, I just play retro old games and sometimes I need that. And you'd be like, nah, man, you don't need it. And you'd be like, nah, you're a liar. Because I don't know why I'm doing this whole ghetto like voice, but still, I need it. So, yeah. Uh. Oh, so now we're going to be choosing uh, the main hero from the last game. If you had a Dragon Ball Z universe, uh, save file from your PS4 or Xbox One, and you moved it over to this game, well, he shows. But if you don't, I guess you just have to pick a random person. And he looks closest to the character that I chose for Xenoverse 1. So I'm going to go with that character, Ace, uh, once we get back to him in a second. And there it is, Ace. There you go. And all it's gonna do is just like load, like him as the the, the, the statue or something like that. It, it, that's gonna be all it is for a minute, like a minute or two, you know. Just like watch. I think at this point I'm like wanting to skip like so bad. Cause I'm actually trying to episode, uh, end the episode in my mind right now to like give myself in the future like time to talk about whatever, but. There's really not nothing else to talk about, man. There really isn't. But thank you, my past self, about thinking like that. So, anyways, um, oh my God, come on, stop falling asleep. My eyes are closing, especially my left eye. It's just so damn tired, and I feel a bit dizzy every time I do shit. So I'm like, yeah, and I'm moving around a little bit so I don't fall asleep. So it's like chicken, you know. All right, uh, let's see here. Yeah, I'm and I'm, I'm at the one minute mark. All right, dude, I like how that Shemron is. He's like so fucking cool, Shemron. Freaking a, dude. I wonder that's where Shenron always goes to protect. Uh, like he always goes back into Dragon Balls and like, okay, I'm gonna go back to protect this and what's not. And he's like, his only upset, uh, exception is to get out is the Dragon Balls because it it defies the test of time or something. I don't know. Anyways, everybody, thank you for watching. Don't forget to like the video, subscribe below, and I, oh man, that's a freaking cool ass hoverboard right there. And of course, don't like to uh, like the video, subscribe below, and see you all for our next episode. Let's play uh, a demo and or next episode of Tale of Shadow X, which is not gonna be Dragon Ball's Universe 2. But hey, hopefully I get the game one day. So once again, everybody, thank you for watching. See you all for the next. Okay, bye.